Hey guys, and welcome to What's Up Dude. Hello guys. Hi guys. And welcome back to this new episode of What's Up Dude podcast. So, just like the usual, how are you? I hope you're doing fine. How are you, Leslie? I'm doing good. You're doing how, good? Yeah, how are you? Me, me too, I'm doing good. That's wonderful. That is fantastic. <laughs> So, as you saw in the title of this episode, we're going to talk about travel again, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and especially like Leslie Leslie's <laughs> travel <laughs> to Africa, like South Africa. Yeah. Um, so, like how it how it was. Um, what did you enjoy the most? What did you do here? With who you've been? So yeah, uh, let's start. And um, let's go. So why Africa, first of all? Yeah, why Africa? Let's just okay. start with uh, Well, at first, we had planned to go to the US again. Um, uh, with who my, is we, by the way? <laughs> yeah, with my mother and my sister okay. uh, to do like a trip, but more like, um, you know, about the civil war? okay yeah so yeah, it was yeah, yeah. A, a trip but like very very rewarding um this and different wars in general like we had planned to visit gemstown for example the first colony okay. in the u.s so yeah it was it we, it was pretty cool but you know it was before february and if you are you know with us in this world you know what happened in february with um russia Oh, okay, because I was like, what, 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 what happened? happened? <laughs> you know, what, what, know. what is going on? <laughs> I was like, I don't know, I'm not in this world right now. <laughs> uh, yeah, um, so, you know, with Russia, I'm not gonna explain what happened. Yeah, it was um, like, yeah, tense. yeah, exactly. And so we started to be scared uh, about what the future, just the future, you know, not only in France, but like in the world. And so my mom was like, you know what, maybe we're going to cancel this uh, trip. And I was like, you know what, you're right. Like, you know, uh, yeah. we have a life to travel. It's okay. Uh, like, it's literally a war. A war, yeah. It's okay, you know, just cancel. It's, 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 it's good. And she was like, yeah, but you know what, <laughs> I really want to travel. So I'm like, yeah, I know, but like, it's... <laughs> You know, you come on right now. Yeah, you know, the war. And <laughs> and so she was like, yeah, you know, but like South Africa seems cool. And I'm like, yeah, it, it's true. Yeah. And she was like, maybe we should go there because, you know, uh, I'm not saying South Africa is not involved uh, in, you know, in the world, but like the relation with Russia is different than the, yes you know with the u.s so like it's not directly in contact with them exactly so it was if, a little bit safer yeah exactly to and it, to be honest if south africa is involved in a problem with russia it means that actually all the world like yeah you know it's it's anyway so we just planned to go to south africa because it's safer it was it was and it is safer uh because of the war and yeah, just South Africa because actually we we thought about going there before COVID happened. Okay. Uh, because uh, we plan to go to Japan, but you know COVID, so we're like, okay, so maybe South Africa, and then you know COVID just traveled more than us, so uh, we cancel everything, and you know South Africa is always here. So has always been on your list of travel. Exactly. So okay. we should we just took the opportunity and yeah okay so you went with your mother and your sister yeah was it your first time here like first uh, time in south africa or like first time in the african continent uh you know, yeah uh different? first time in africa first time in south africa like literally I mean, first time yeah in really 
you really oh yeah, yeah. You, you've never been like to morocco i forgot no <laughs> no my mom did but not me. yeah yeah not you <laughs> okay so it was it was your first like encounter with the african continent and yeah. like african like not population but i will say like culture people yeah, that culture yeah yeah okay um so talking about culture yeah uh, what was like something you noticed there that was different from where you live and um what did you enjoy the most uh, from their culture yeah. um so it's yeah it's obvious but, like it's very different from europe and even the u.s uh even though you can still feel the little you know british history there yeah um because for example the first thing when noticed with my mom is like the roads are so similar to the u.s really yeah just the fact that they're driving like at the left of the road and they drive on the left yeah that's but weird. that's it unless that it's like the u.s like the roads are the u.s like the the principal roads because like the small roads gosh i know what you're talking what you're talking you're yeah yeah if you don't care. <laughs> what you are talking about <laughs> yeah if you don't care about your car go ahead but like <laughs> yeah it's like there are whole holes yeah yeah, yeah uh, don't worry i've yeah. been there like not in africa but i've been yeah on the roads like that and it's like at first we're like oh that's surprising but like it's funny I like yeah it. but like my mom was so stressed because she was like oh my god we're gonna lose the car oh my god oh my god we're in the middle of nowhere and i'm like yeah but so your mom was driving yeah did you no 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 uh my sister didn't either uh okay because uh are you gonna get an international license driver um my mom did my sister did but like i'm really like i just passed my uh driver license like what two years ago yeah so my mom is like if something <laughs> happened to me or to your sister yeah sure you will drive but like okay you know we have two people before you drive yeah. <laughs> so like it's cool and it's also more expensive uh when you um take a car there okay you ask for several drivers oh yeah it's the I case in everywhere that. You know? yeah so... so the culture yeah like sorry okay. um the culture um yeah it's it's very people are really nice uh i think it's just friends you know we're we're not that nice <laughs> um, they are welcoming to you yeah yeah like, sure okay. um they are like you know you need an information or anything they're like yeah sure i can help and and even people who know um who who don't have anything want to help Mm -hmm. you know and or you know something i noticed too is like people who ask for money because they need it when you say no it's like okay that's cool and they're not know, going to bother you yeah exactly and it's like that's cool okay and yeah they're not they're really nice and not aggressive or yeah like, just like, like you can find in paris sometimes yeah exactly and yeah in paris you you literally can be insulted because you didn't give yes. money and like there i've never been insulted or anything you know uh even though uh, they know we are tourists and yeah, they yeah, know yeah. we're literally rich for them because mm -hmm. yeah uh, the salary there the income um it's lower than lower. it's like 200 dollars okay. so it's like 180 euros 108 100 100 okay 100 yeah, 1, yeah you get it it's like okay, for a whole month, so obviously for for them we're like super rich okay. um but yeah no the culture like really cool people are nice music is cool oh my god i love music um, um sorry if you can hear my cats <laughs> <laughs> um talking about culture we cannot forget food um did you eat like traditional food from there also we talk about south africa but um that is a country so yeah. where like in which town oh um, yeah sure city have you stayed uh okay so regarding the food uh the thing is uh we didn't eat that much in general like we eat twice a day once at like 8 a.m and 
like the second time was at I don't know 6 p.m. Okay. So we like we didn't ha have the opportunity to you know to eat in a um, typical restaurant or whatever because okay. we that's, actually that's had sad. yeah it's sad but like we had so much to do so many things to visit and. Um, yes, you you could have like tried the fruits because uh, I know. yeah actually it was it was really complicated to find well for me for us to find like typical food there because like even when you you walk around the beach or whatever I didn't notice anything you know regarding the food I'm pretty sure there is but like I don't know I actually okay next time you go yeah even even because I wasn't in a uh, typical hotel i was in a um, guest house okay uh in three guest house in guest houses yeah and um every time you know they didn't propose anything like typical from i don't know if you like i don't know if you wrote a comment but maybe you should have like put this like oh yeah well you should have like put traditional fruits because i don't know like if you if I go to Africa or, or like South Africa, particularly, I will try the fruits for sure because mm. like, I like yeah. this. So like you had so much to do and like, oh, oh, oh yeah, three... oh, also, uh, the okay. regarding the cities, cause you asked me, the yeah, city, because I went to Cape Town. I went That's also the capital. To... Mm, well, there are one official capital, which is Petrolia, Petroria, yeah, Petroria. Okay. Okay. Um, no, Pretoria. Oh gosh, I don't know how to say that in English. Pretoria. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Um, I'm I'm not familiar with that. Uh, that's okay. Um, but like when we talk to someone from there, they're like, actually, there are four capitals. It's like big cities, if you want. It's it's oh, very okay. complicated, but like Cape Town is one of the biggest uh, cities uh, there. Uh, we also went to um, Cap of Good Hope. Uh, yeah, you know. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't do a word in, in French. Um, we went to Pretoria. Yeah. <laughs> we went to um, Johannesburg. And, yeah. And, and, and we went to Sun City, which is in the middle of nowhere, to be honest. But, Sun City? Yeah, Sun City is more That's like... That's a pretty name. Yeah, it's more like um, kind of... An amusement park, like very, ah. very big. Top three activities that you did. I'm a chick. Like, <laughs> if you recommend, like, oh, I know. If the first one goes to South Africa. What are the top three things that you did that you've done that you would recommend to them? Okay, first one. Um. Oh my God, I forgot the name. Yeah, because the name of the places are quite difficult to remember um yeah, in English, right? yeah. They, they speak yeah. English it's uh okay let me search du, 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 du. it's like oh my god i don't know how to say that kirsten bosch it's like a garden in cape town it's the um biggest garden in the in the country or one of the biggest in the world like um, botanical garden exactly okay. um so it's damn i <laughs> i'm kind of good at that <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> it's it's really cute and you know it's very calm it's it's I don't i'm know. just gonna plug your socials so if you want to see the photos um that leslie posted you can follow her at worlds and adventures on ig <laughs> <laughs> okay you can thank continue you um then uh wow so much things i would say okay Driving i would say mandela's mandela's houses mandela's house yeah yeah um, yeah of course in soweto because uh he had he had several houses but like the one in soweto is is it's like history you know it's it's you you cannot not feel something when you go there um but soweto is it's it's um it's a neighborhood where if you don't know where you're going you're you're you will be lost okay and so had an in, you need to have an uh, itinerary uh yeah but you also need to have like a, a guide tour a tour guide. oh a look yeah a local guide tour yeah 
tour guide. <laughs> yeah, I don't know <laughs> which sense for this word, yeah, but tour it, guide, I think. Yeah. Um. But yeah, it is really, really cool. And 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 last one, I would say. Oh, I know. Oh my god, this should be the first one. But like the safari. Oh yeah. I did. It's I in... I actually forgot that you could like do <laughs> safari tour here. It's in in Palensburg National Park. Uh it is work. Okay. It's it's uh it's actually one of it's really big. It's like so big that um the park is in three countries. Oh, uh, okay. Like yeah. 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 On this like okay. Yeah. <laughs> I yeah. get it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Because <laughs> Okay, one part is in South Africa, and yeah. I don't know the country near it, but um, yeah. It's like, okay. oh my god, I don't know how to say that. It's Zim Zimba oh, Zimbabwe. Zim yeah, I don't know how to say it in English. Yeah, me too. And Botswana. Botswana. Yeah. Do you know why I know this country? No. Because when I was little, uh, they had this advertisement for a cake, which is actually called... Um, in French, it is called savane. Oh yeah, and you you could have like stickers, and then if you collect them, you could like um, make a Africa oh, yeah, on your true. fridge. Yeah. And I had one, and it was the Botswana country. So that's why. Cool. Cool. Anyway. Story. <laughs> <laughs> um. Yeah. So that's it. You know. But like in general, when you go to Africa, you should find like national parks. Cause... Yeah, that's super big. Yeah, like they have so much things to visit, and like, like the nature and the environment here is so diverse mm -hmm. that yeah, like I saw your picture and that was beautiful. Like, wow! Thank I you. wish I could like <laughs> experience this. <laughs> yeah. Also, yeah. you you've been to the national park. Did you see any animals that you've never saw? Of course, in real life. Of course, that was the goal, you know. But I was kind of sad because around like 1 p.m., we only uh, saw one elephant. Oh. So I was like, it's cool, you know, but, you know, we spent the day there. So we should see more. Um, and then, oh my God, something happened. I saw a, how do you say that in English? A, a giraffe? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> giraffe. Wait. Anyway, something really big with a really <laughs> with big a neck. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> giraffe? I think. It yeah, is. you should. You should, with Google translation. That's, that's what. That's what I'm going to do right now. But I think it is a giraffe. Giraffe. Yeah. yeah, that's a giraffe. But I need to know how we pronounce it. So wait a minute. Giraffe. Yeah, I was right. <laughs> giraffe. Giraffe. Yeah, we saw giraffe. giraffe. We saw some weird, weird birds like pretty cool but i don't know the name um we saw uh oh my god i really really don't know the name in english I saw... what is the name in french it's i'm pretty much yeah it's the same it's like rhinoceros R rhino, rhino? <laughs> now you can say rhino rhino is that it? Yeah. rhino rhino and then rhino. we saw elephants of course and then we saw baboons i love them and then we like, saw zebra I like monkeys yeah well, zebras oh zebras, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um they're so cute yeah we saw a, rhino, a lot of but... animals that was wait that wait, was wait, cool. wait rhinoceros 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 yeah uh, i'm going so, to say rhino <laughs> yeah so i saw a little giraffe yeah yeah that was my goal i saw actually i saw two or no, I saw four. The first one, she was alone, like chilling alone in the sun. Uh, chilling alone <laughs> in the sun. And then uh, I saw another group. There were three. So yeah, I was so happy. And you also got got a giraffe plushie. Yeah, sure. Yeah, Yay. of course. <laughs> if I go to Africa, yeah. Um. My top animal that I want to see is like one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. Is a meerkat. Okay, um, what is that? <laughs> that is a meerkat. Meerkat. Okay. 
they're so cute i like them so much like I, i i hope you're gonna see them one day i saw them at the zoo when i was yeah. i don't know where but i saw them and i have a, like a plushy mm. near cats anyway um continue on the on the travel diary <laughs> yeah so we've talked about like national parks and um culture mm -hmm. just let's just speak about um your feelings and experience like have you like okay have you experienced negative things in this country and yeah i don't know just you know yeah you, um was, I it, was it safe oh okay. was it, i don't know uh so i remember uh one day it was actually our first day um we experienced two negative things the first one was like uh you know in this country you had to pay someone and then they check the car not check but like they they're watching your car oh uh, yeah you don't you don't pay a parking well in the street i'm talking about um so like the first day we went to it's like a street where there are um houses but like colorful houses so a lot of tourists go there and we we parked and we were planning to pay the guy who was in front of us and he told us like um sh actually i don't want money and we're like what yeah i just need you to pay me something at the supermarket and i was like okay like i mean okay. maybe you need food i don't know so we went there was uh, it really for food uh it was for it's like baby stuff you know oh and, okay. and it was like it's for my my, my little sister and we're like okay yeah the thing is uh he told us it was um in euros it's like 50 euros 50 like five zero okay. uh, yeah. in dollars it's like yeah, i don't know 60 yeah 65 i don't know for baby and stuff and it's only two products It's like no more than 15 euros. Also, what you paid at the store was like $50. Actually, when my mom looked at me, because it's not in euros, of course, and it's not in dollars. Yeah. It's, so she looked at me and I was like doing the <laughs> translation. The, the math. Yeah. And, and, and I was like, oh, mom, it's like 50 euros. It's not possible. And so she looked at the guy and she, she was like, I'm, I'm sorry, you know, I just only got usually you pay the guy like i don't know like less than 10 euros you know so she was like oh, I'm, okay. I'm, i'm sorry i only got like five euros and she was like and he was like i really really need you to pay that and they they take the credit card and all the stuff and you know i was with my mom and my sister and like three girls in a small supermarket surrounded by five guys You know, yeah and we're like, were like pressuring you yeah exactly and my mom was like i'm sorry i cannot pay you that and so i don't know i felt like for not that long but like maybe a minute we're like very stressed and we're like is something going to happen the first day <laughs> yay so yeah it was but like after you said no 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 they're like okay i i take your five euros that's it and nothing happened um grateful for that because i told you people are not very violent you know they just ask you maybe several times but like and if you say no they will respect your choice yeah that's it mm -hmm. and the same day we went to a beach and you know a, a, an artist wanted to show his um art his, <laughs> yeah his heart is um draws and you know we're like no sorry sorry no okay and at some point <laughs> the guy just told her hey you know what uh you should at least check because you know it's kind of racist you know he, he really told us like you're racist and was, and was like what like <laughs> i would have been i wouldn't have been there if i was <laughs> you know and, and i was like yeah exactly and i was like what like you cannot call us racist just because we haven't checked your drawers i think you know? it just wanted you your attention maybe yeah and... us to react or whatever and and <laughs> i don't know it was it was really weird the first day but like 
that's it that's happened but of um gratefully and it wasn't yeah. bad and to be honest bad it, things like quote unquote you know yeah it, it could have happened everywhere to be honest and it's not just yeah. south africa so but overall i think this travel for you was more positive than negative of course of course but you know it, it happened so many things in like what 10 days like mm. um so i told you the guys uh oh also i forgot to tell to tell you um we actually heard gunfires uh, oh nice <laughs> <laughs> i don't know if it's nice but no, no, no. uh i was joking yeah uh it's like it was 10 p.m we were like looking at our pictures and we're like you know chilling and no, just getting fires yeah and at some points we oh my god actually i remember i heard you know yelling and i was like oh gosh oh no okay what have and, then, that? and then yeah yelling yelling screaming and then first shot and was like mm. i looked at my mom is that fireworks <laughs> i was like i've never heard this before so it's not mm. fireworks you know and and then i heard a scream like a long scream oh, and then no. a second shot like no noise oh, so still... like quiet That's scary and then like 10 seconds later we heard the the car the police car no the car oh, just... the, probably okay. the guy or whatever um the 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 car like she the guy or the the oh, woman yeah. who did that actually run away and like i don't know maybe five or ten minutes later later we heard the cops like it's mm. really you know it's 10 p.m you were chilling and at some point you heard someone maybe <laughs> who was killed and you're like okay okay yeah 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 i it's, wish it's i'm weird i wish i'm like i really hope not wish i really hope that i'm never going to hear that sound mm. Because yeah, I would have been traumatized. Yeah. Uh, uh, so yeah. Yeah. And then, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. But like, we had fun stories, but not like, uh, you know, traumatizing or anyway. It's just fun. You know, not fun. Well, I'm reading something <laughs> I wrote. It's like <laughs> the suitcase has been positive to the control. Oh, yeah. It, you had it's me. not fun, right? It's not fun because uh it's not fun just it's 5 a.m like what the heck mm. <laughs> I, I think it's like it's like um random uh controls yeah. because sometimes you know at the airport they need to check every 50 people and mm. you happen to be the 50th people so. um it's not yeah we have been like controlled our body yeah it was but, like, also the suitcase yeah, yeah uh, like you also are, are you being controlled so yeah but not not like control like oh we're gonna check you know you know just kind of <laughs> control no way it was 5 a.m the guy was like i need someone and a, a girl just appeared with a gun looked at us the break? i know because it was being positive to um oh so uh, maybe, maybe. i don't know it's like very how do you say that explosive drugs no explosive no. like like boom <laughs> bombing things yeah something like that bombing materials yeah it was 5 a.m after like an 10 hour flight and we're like what <laughs> and so yeah we just we've been controlled but everything was good you know we're not terrorists so um is there anything that you want to tell the listeners yeah okay i feel like i did ask the question that i wanted to ask yeah okay i i think i need to just tell people um that sometimes i feel like people were crazy to be honest because the first hour in africa was crazy okay my mom was trying to uh drive in at the left of the road and um i can't even drive on the right <laughs> <laughs> and, at some point we were on the highway is uh -huh. that it? yeah highway yes and and like people literally cross the highway like it oh is, like okay like, like pedestrians yeah <laughs> like it is a normal road like i remember i saw like a literally a dude like 
coming from uh how do you call that let me search the bush the bush uh, like right. the, the yeah the bush. the bush yeah a dude coming from the bush like and just crossing the the highway you know like, like what are you doing here yeah and my mom was like oh my god oh my god i'm gonna kill someone i'm gonna <laughs> She was so I'm scared. driving on the left and I don't know how to drive on the left <laughs> and people are crossing the highway like what the freak I'm going 110 <laughs> miles per hour. And I remember at some point, uh like maybe a week after we arrived there, we saw a guy doing a, a U turn. A U turn? Yeah. Okay, not a roundabout, okay. A, a U turn in on the highway. Like the speed, like how did you do that and like was like okay skills. it's normal you know should do skills yeah. i wish i could do that and i learned something in africa everything you think you know you don't know okay <laughs> there is no rule uh sometimes uh but like sometimes you're like what the fuck in no, yeah yeah it's like normal you just have to not think as a european you know this trip was probably one of the most rewarding one because you know you think a lot about your life in france in europe in general and you're like i'm really lucky you know because mm. it's 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 like unfortunately it's really it, it's usual to see people asking money for you know having a meal for a day and then i i knew it you know but like when you see it every 10 minutes it's like what I don't know you have to see that i i had to see that to realize how lucky i am and how grateful i am so yeah <laughs> I'm, I, i'm just like listening you know you guys can, cannot see my face but like i'm like no ding i'm like yay feel you um yeah so... well, oh so one funny story uh when i left for africa it was the presidential the election day Okay, yeah. when you left or when you arrived? Left? When I left. Okay, pretty. So, pretty yeah, pretty when pretty my, pretty my pretty first pretty. Uh, flight left Paris, it yeah. was actually the exact hour, minute uh, that we knew who was. Oh, election day in France. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Like, and oh, election day in Africa, yay. No, no, it wasn't in France. <laughs> and I remember a guy, like literally, he like the i don't know maybe the last 10 seconds before we uh, we yeah we, land yeah uh, take off no yeah take off <laughs> thank you um the, the last 10 seconds before we took off he he just like scream because he saw the results oh. and i was like what oh my god <laughs> And it was so funny because I was like, <laughs> it was a scream of joy because the I'm not sure, but like, no. <laughs> but like the other candidate, I'm not gonna no, say anything. Actually, he wasn't happy. The guy wasn't happy of the result. But anyway, you know, uh, okay, it's politics. Uh, and and I was like, bro, you're leaving France. You're going. We were going to Germany before going to South Africa. So I don't know where this guy was going, but he was going at least to Germany. And I was like, bro, what are you doing? Like stop watching the news and checking in like literally 10 seconds it was before. important it was important but like it can went it can wait like it was not even an hour to go to germany i don't know because i know where i was and like i was working and the second i like got off work that's the first thing i checked too yeah i mean yeah but like when you're in a plane and we literally like 10 seconds left yeah, yeah i don't know how this guy got wi-fi to be honest <laughs> you, can pay. you can pay maybe maybe on the plane i wouldn't i wouldn't be surprised but like <laughs> i would have paid <laughs> but like yeah anyway that's oh also uh we don't have so much time yet but i failed like shit i eat shit okay i ate shit at the cap of good hope like you didn't like the food or no i you, oh I, you fall I, like you i fell fall, like yeah I you fell. fell okay i was like what, what? i don't understand i didn't really Eight. eat shit <laughs> but like um yeah I, I i yeah my ass oh my god my my legs oh my god 
I feel like not that, that was awful, you know. I didn't even <laughs> feel like normal people. I really I don't know how my body did that. So okay, anyway, it happened. Yeah. I'm alive. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing that counts. Yeah. So as a sum up, I would say this travel for you was a human experience. Yeah. Um, open your eyes on many things, even if you already knew them. Um, was also a historical tour, mm -hmm. an important historical tour because we all know like black history and white people history. Yeah, and and, and if you go to Africa, go visit Robben Island. Uh, it's where Mandela spends eighteen years. So in it's prison? yeah. So that's very glad that you are actually interested in the world history, but also like the black history, and that's. I think all people should know at least about it. And um, yeah, so if you want to go to South Africa, just listen to this podcast and you will, <laughs> <laughs> you will know what to do, what to not do and what to visit. If you stay there for like 10 days, which is a lot actually. Yeah. And you can do a lot in 10 days. And um, I don't know, do you want to like finish the, the episode? It is about your travel so yeah sure so first if you want to follow us on instagram it's uh what's up dude pod right <laughs> yeah i yeah. think <laughs> i think so i don't know yeah um if you want to see some pictures yeah it's Beautiful on my pictures. account instagram account it's like world and adventures um and also i did a vlog in africa so you can check the landscape and everything in the video on my youtube channel which is also word and adventures everything will be in the description i feel like i'm a youtuber <laughs> uh but yeah uh you know um we're happy to be back too and to record this episode because it, it has been a while but yeah if you have any like um topics that you want us to talk about do not hesitate to dm us or just you know send an email and we'll be glad to talk about the topic you suggest yeah um i guess it's the end yeah. see you very soon guys thank you for listening and bye bye bye